Hello, Ice Road Truckers, or should I say Snow Runner Truckers? It's WCL Wobbly County Logistics, and we are in Alaska. Get your woolly hat on, it's gonna be a cold one. So, we're going today to be playing through this task here Bags on the Ice. So let's just have a look where the actual bags on the ice are and there looks like there's going to be four of them that we've got to collect and I need a bigger truck, first mistake, so I'm going to have to do two runs on this one. I think we should be okay with fuel, not too worried about that because I believe there is a gas station nearby. So let's get on the road, let's go and try and collect these bags on the ice. So my choice of truck today was the White Star. This has been a very good truck, especially in the early stages of the game. It's never failed me yet, it is slightly upgraded and... Um, I prefer this than the International Paystar. I've uh, been able to achieve a lot more with this truck. I still haven't got the locking differential um, gearbox yet. There must be an upgrade for that. I've not been able to find it yet. Has anybody got it? Where do you actually locate that? So I can highly recommend this truck, you get it on the first map in Michigan, I believe you have to fish it out of a pond or something similar, but it is well worth dragging back to the garage, believe me, it's a, it's a cracking piece of kit. So there is our first crate, I'm just going to position myself. Hopefully we won't get stuck. <laughs> I don't generally get stuck a great deal in this truck. It's a really good truck. So we're going to use this high ab, this crane here for the uh, for the first time. We'll put the legs out and uh, we'll see how we get on. I'm not normally very good with this because um, the camera angles I find really annoying and it's difficult to see sometimes. So uh, the more I use it the better I'm going to get, no doubt. So hopefully this won't take too long. You might just have to bear with me while I uh, fiddle around trying to get this, uh, this crate on the back of the vehicle. I wish they'd move that hood there with all the buttons on what you, that you press for the, for the crane thing, the jiggy thing here. I wish that would be at the top of the screen because it obscures the view. It does me head in, man. It does me head in. Reminds me of that game it's, uh, in the arcades where you have that crane and you have to pick them teddies up. <laughs> right, that's the first one. Let's go and get the uh, second one, which is just up the road here. We'll, uh, we'll go get that one. Hopefully. Let's just see how good this truck is at getting um, through this snow here. Oh, are we going to get stuck? Or are we going to have to winch out? Nice and steady in the low gears. There we go. Not a problem for the white star.
Okay, let's see how quickly we can actually get this loaded on the back of the vehicle. How are you? How are you guys getting on with this crane? How are you finding it? Have you got used to it yet? Or are you a lot quicker than me than me than loading up? I'm finding I'm getting a little bit quicker with it. At first, it was absolutely useless. I'm not brilliant now, but uh, I'm a lot better than one than what I was when I first uh, started doing this. There we go, that wasn't too bad, didn't take too much time, I have uh, I have done a lot worse than that believe me, so let's, uh, let's just pack it all the way and don't forget to secure the load on the back of the truck because if you don't there's a possibility you can lose it. So we're all secured, we're all ratcheted down, we're strapped down, so let's go back and um, we'll tip our first load. I believe we can just turn around down here where the pipe goes over the road here. We can, we'll just we'll just spin around here and go back and we'll unload. Um, because unfortunately the mistake I made, I didn't come with a big enough truck. You see, my dispatcher for this job didn't actually tell me there was four bags. So we brought the small truck. So how many times have you guys actually rolled these trucks over? I've rolled them over quite a few times. Oh, flaming F. I knew that was going to happen in the outside cameras. Give it a tree wobbly. Back it up, driver. too sure in the last update that they did for this game where they've actually improved the hands on the steering wheel as well I don't seem to be driving like a drunken fool down the road I think they've uh, I think they've done something there they seem a lot more a lot more slower they used to be really fast I used to drive like a man possessed under the influence of alcohol <laughs> Come on, driver, sort your gearbox out. So let's unload the first, the first load, we'll, we'll do auto unload, I think there is an option to do it manually, so now we've got to locate the, uh, the other two, so which way shall we go, I want to try and maybe go northbound and then over to the west, 
which is down this track here. I'm going to put these markers down just to aid me because we've got no sat navs up here. The mobile phones and satellite technology doesn't work in these parts of Alaska. You're low on fuel you could have actually turned right just down there um, I believe that sign said gas and there's a gas station just just down the road so I'm actually okay for fuel I think we've got enough fuel in to do this particular task I just wish I came up here in a in a, uh, in a bigger truck and I could have just done it all in one loop in one go trial and error trial and error oh it's time to go through the wheel wash or is it frozen Oh, it's ice, it's ice. We got the chains on, we'll be okay. Ice road trucking. So what truck did you guys use to do this particular task? Or, or should I say, did you come up here with a trailer? Because I obviously didn't, and it's going to take me a lot longer. I've, got, I've had to do it in two trips. So luckily, the next one is just just here. So I'm not going to bother. I haven't bothered strapping the cargo down. It'll be fine just to go that short way. And uh, we'll have another go at loading up.
Right, there we go. So, we just got to secure the vehicle, put the crane away, put the legs, retract the legs, and uh, strap the cargo down. Quite an easy job, this one, compared to some of them in the game. Right. Let's go unload. Let's head back. How's the fuel? Oh, we're okay for fuel. We've got about half a tank of fuel in there, approximately. So we're going to be okay for fuel. Back over the ice. Has anybody put any mods in the game yet? I haven't put any mods in my game yet at the moment. I'm, uh, I'm playing through the game completely standard, all standard trucks. I want to do everything at the moment with the standard trucks and then I'll play around with mods. Maybe do some mod reviews in the future as well. But for now, I just want to plod on through the game um, using all the standard vehicles. I don't want to have any sort of advantage by using a mod at the moment. So here we go, that's another one under our belt as a SnowRunner trucker. Another task completed up here in Alaska. Now if you're still here and you enjoyed the video, you're awesome. Don't forget to smack that like button and uh, I'll be back with another SnowRunner video uh, shortly. Thanks for watching.